happy Sunday and let's get Christmassy. <laughs> like, Josh might not be letting me get the Christmas decorations out just yet, but that doesn't mean to say that I can't be doing Christmas themed vlogs because I am just so excited for Christmas. And there is a lot of Christmassy stuff to talk about today. <laughs> um, I've got some new like Christmassy things to show you. We're gonna discuss the mess that is Christmas Corner and Advent calendars because there are two days until December. So it is a very, very exciting time. So we'll start off with the calendars probably. Um, like I think we mentioned yesterday, we've got a, a Disney calendar that we used to fill up. But despite the fact that we're 29 and 31, <laughs> our parents still buy calendars for us. So we've sort of had to like ditch the idea of filling up our calendar um, because we still have chocolate calendars bought for us. So this is what we've got this year. Good old traditional dairy milk. <laughs> we've got just one of those each, obviously. Um, from Josh's mum and then we have Thornton's ones as well from my dad now usually he buys the ones um, where you get the thing at the bottom and it's got your name iced on it but with everything that's gone on this year he couldn't get the iced ones so oh I've got hair everywhere so he just dropped those on the doorstep this morning and we are all set for the 1st of December, which is just, can, can you tell that I am very excited for Christmas? <laughs> um, next thing, I'm pretty sure Josh showed you at the start of the week in one of the vlogs that we bought a very cute doormat from Aldi, a Christmas doormat, because I wanted a Christmas doormat for quite a while now. And with 2020 being the year it's been, I plan on going like full on festive this year, like the tree's going up on Friday but we're going um, shopping the day before for more like homely Christmas things and I'm just so excited because I just want the house to be like Santa's grotto basically. So from the second you step in the house it'll just be like BAM Christmas. <laughs> so Yes, Christmas doormat, we got that at the start of the week. We went back to Aldi today and got more, more Christmassy home things. And they're just so cute. So we got, I'm gonna hold it the right way around, this cushion that says, it's Christmas, with this cute little tree on it. Then we got another one that says, let it snow. How cute are they, right? Look at them. So festive. I've wanted blue and grey. I know this is like a, a greeny blue, but these sort of colours anyway, Christmas cushions, because we repainted the living room last year and it's like jewel tones now. So reds and stuff don't really go, but it's so hard to find like these sort of colours in Christmas cushions because everywhere is just red. But we got them. Aldi Aldi delivered <laughs> and came up with some very pretty cushions for five pounds each. While we were there, we also picked up a game because what is Christmas without the game? <laughs> um, so we got, the, oh, my hair is so annoying today, um, Word It Out, which is just like a, a buzzer game. From what I can gather, it says set contains 100 easy word cards, 100 hard word cards, sand timer, buzzer and instructions. So I think like you get like look look i'll just show the example so i think you're given like a topic and then how many words you have to describe that topic in i'm thinking a few drinks over christmas and playing this it's going to be pretty hilarious i don't even know how much it was i think it was like seven pound and they had two other like a doodle one and a quiz one i think as well so yeah that is the festival hall <laughs> Next topic of festive discussion is Christmas Corner. You've probably heard us mention Christmas Corner um, a few times before. It's basically where we dump all the Christmas presents. Um, please tell me that we aren't the only ones that have like a Christmas Corner in our house. It's like basically somewhere that you put all the gifts so they're kind of out of the way but it still looks kind of messy. 
our Christmas corner is in our spare room and it's it's very full so excuse the mess but we are going to show Christmas corner and if you have a Christmas corner as well do let us know in the comments that we're not the only ones <laughs> whose house looks like a bomb's hit it at this time of year so this is our Christmas corner there's the big old pack of wrapping paper that we talked about in yesterday's vlog and the Christmas doormat as well <laughs> buried under there and then it basically is just a mountain of gifts like everything in this corner aside from the guitars obviously is for Christmas so we've just got boxes, bags, random presents it, it's looking very full we are pretty much well i'm pretty much done shopping josh isn't <laughs> so christmas corner is probably gonna get fuller hey look i'm here um while lauren was doing that i went to find some sellotape like we've yes. got sellotape but we've not got much sellotape like when do you ever need sellotape really <laughs> at christmas <laughs> yeah exactly at christmas so like the last time that we used sellotape was probably at christmas Anyway, I found some more sellotape in the garage, of all places, for whatever reason. You'll have definitely been tinkering down there with something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, I've got a, a tape shelf. I've got a shelf for different tapes, like packing I mean, tape, sellotape, electrical if you thought, tape. She thought Christmas tape. corner was weird. <laughs> you have not seen the tape table. <laughs> shelf. Tape shelf. Oh, I am sorry. Tape shelf. That doesn't sound as good as tape table, though, does it? Shoot up. Anyway, I've got tape. That's today's big success. But I think we're going to do a bit of wrapping up now. Yeah. That's what we're doing. I have to say, once we've wrapped, it all goes back in Christmas Corner as well until the tree's up. Yeah, Christmas um, Corner just looks just as full, but a little more festive. Christmas Corner clears out after Christmas. We put our presents to each other under the tree, don't we? Yeah. But then, like, gifts to parents and nieces and nephews all stay up here. That's not so. to mention gifts from us, <laughs> from, from us we individually. Don't. To ourselves we've discussed this before on the vlog and i always feel like we have to do a bit of a disclaimer because i feel like it's really weird that we buy gifts for ourselves but i'm doing a whole blog post about this in december um and in the course of of doing that i have seen a couple of people who've also said that they buy gifts for themselves here's the um, thing right we've been on. together how long oh wow 13 years in in like three weeks time right 13 years we've bought if we're gonna buy anything for each other we've already bought it so like it, it makes buying presents difficult like yeah I don't, it, anything that we need to buy we just t tend to buy anyway yeah and like i think the thing is um as well like we're buying gifts for ourselves we're not people that spend a lot of money on ourselves throughout the year are we um i mean let's just ignore all the black series <laughs> up there but <laughs> Yeah. Okay, all right, I'll take that back. I'm not someone who spends a lot of money on themselves throughout the year. I prefer to save. Um, and I think we've always, like, you as well, even though you have spent money on the Black Series, that's because you've saved. Um, we do save a lot. <laughs> so I think when it gets to this time of year, I'm just like, treat yourself. <laughs> and treat that, yourself. That, has, that has gone quite crazy this year yeah. i have spent a lot of money on myself but i have worked hard for that so and also it's christmas yeah it's christmas oh well, it will be christmas soon not feel, quite yet <laughs> i feel like i have to say though obviously i do have a job and i've worked overtime and i get paid for some blogging stuff so i essentially do two jobs and overtime so definitely treat yourself <laughs> so suck it <laughs> anyway. why have i got tape in my pocket i've got tape on my arm <laughs> I just reached in my pocket. Look, I've got some tape in there. <laughs> There's not much on that roll. So, anyway, we're gonna go wrap, which in itself isn't very interesting to watch. So maybe I'll show you. I'm gonna put some Christmas tunes on them. Apparently, that's <laughs> happening. So we're gonna wrap, put on Christmas tunes, and, and I'll show you the, uh, the the finished article tomorrow. This <laughs> once again stuffed down there in Christmas corner. Good times. If you enjoyed this vlog, please give it a thumbs up and a subscribe if you're not already. And with that being said, we're going to get it going. So, we'll see you guys next time.